Have again. Fox's friend. <laughs> Thank we're back live again. <laughs> the battery's got. It must be magic. <laughs> it must be magic. Maybe it's Maybelline. I don't know. I don't see you guys online. There you go. You're live again. We live? No. Okay. Stream back. Why am I echoing? Oh, I'm Screw echoing it. her. We'll do it live. I'm echoing through her mic. <laughs> do I sound yeah. okay? You sound yeah, great on my end. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Perfect. Okay. All right. Depends on who you ask. All right. Well, hey, Cindy. I on, guess on we're the, back live. Yeah, yeah. Next to where you would go to disconnect from the call, there's a thing called noise suppression powered by Crisp. If that's not on, turn that on. That might actually help you. Okay, people that were watching, it looks like we lost all of our viewers. <clears throat> that happened long ago. Yeah, it probably happened at the start. No, we actually had about six people in there watching. Ooh. Ooh. Can you guys hear the sound effects? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I Good. have mine turned down a little bit that way. Okay. I don't know how loud it is on the stream, so I don't know. I can't really hear him. I can hear him. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's better. Okay. Yeah, when yeah, I yeah, do yeah. the test on that, I can hear him over my mic. Yeah, I can hear you coming over mine. Okay, I think we're back. We don't have our viewers back, but that's okay. Ah, uh, who needs them? Ah, eh, we don't need viewers. Okay, so, where were we? Get to this fight thing. Here. We were about to fight a furpy. Were you? Okay. Well, yeah. no, we're trying to figure out... I'm trying to figure out why I'm in front. Or why I was in front. I'm not anymore. Which makes me feel a lot better about myself. I am. I offered to go and talk to these animals to keep them quiet. Oh, okay. With that offer, I trust him. I don't know why, but I trust him. Talk and I'm going to start walking into the room. Do you? Here, I'll talk move to, to here animals. so that way we have light in the room so everyone can see. Yes. Well, there's a fire pit. Oh, there is the fire. Yeah, but how, how bright's the light from the fire pit? Oh. It's a, a dark fire. fire I can make it brighter. A dark fire pit. Oh. With pyrotechnology. <laughs> Thaumaturgy? Okay. Thermaturgy. Thermaturgy. Okay. So you guys are coming into that area there. Um, you see. I'm a turd? What? <laughs> so the right. people standing I there. Up, I walk up here to the the goat pen. You can see that the on the pen holds Let's seven. Over the goat. Yeah, there's seven goats. six sheep. Yeah, seven all appear to be in healthy condition. They all appear to be in healthy condition. Ooh, good. One of those two-way petting zoos. Yeah. I, I reach out over and I. Put my hand out and point at all of them, and I say, "Hey, all you goats, y'all shut up! <laughs> y'all shut up!" There you go. That'll keep them quiet. I think, I think you actually kind of scared them a little bit. Um, they start. You need to use the charisma. You need to use the charisma like babe. I'm, I'm starting to lose my trust. They're bleeding. They start bleeding and uh, not bleeding, but bleating. Wait, bleeding? Just like, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's long leaving. He points his finger right at they all die. I match you too. So metal. <laughs> you went to the dark side. Okay, so they start to like, kind of like, get a little scared and they're kind of moving around, making some noise. Um, yeah, they're, they're, they're kind of making some noise, basically, yeah. That normally works. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, so as you guys look about the uh, the cave, um, Karhu and Himdol, you see the fire, and there's something roasting on the fire. Um, as you kind of take a look at it, it 
seem to be what would be a four-legged creature. It doesn't look like a four-legged creature. It has two legs. Six legs? Oh. Two legs. <laughs> well, you know, there's lots of good two-legged creatures. They taste all right. What is it? Can I tell? Well, let's see here. Yeah, I'm going to try Please to be take a look here. Okay. Be no on, Why gnome? Why? It looks like... Typically gnome. It, what, you don't, it you looks... Don't gnome? No, it looks short. Yeah, you right. Know, kind of stout. Kind of stout. Yeah. Um, Can I do like a medicine it looks, check? Sure. They're dead. Whatever it is, it's roasting. It kind of <laughs> smells funny. It smells funny. Okay, so it's probably You're sure it's dead. <laughs> what was your medicine check? Let's see. 17? Okay. You know that whatever it is, it's humanoid. It's a short humanoid, and it's roasting on the fire. I uh, try to take it off, like, just, like, get it off the fire. Okay. Do I see, Do I see any other tracks around here? I'm thinking that this is not the Burbeeg that we're dealing with. There are tracks. There are a lot of tracks all over this area. Large tracks and some of the from the animals. Um, when you uh, so Himdal, when you're taking off, trying to get this thing off the fire, you notice there's a small bundle um, near a log by the fire. A bundle of logs? No. As you look closer, it's not a bundle of logs. You see actually what looks like a battle axe and some thick leather leather boots and some clothing. So at least they undressed him before they started cooking him <laughs> as I look into that bundle. Yeah. This is not good. Mm, tasty. I try to look for any type of uh, uh, piece of equipment that might be able to help identify this poor soul. Find a wallet. Okay. I don't know, dog tags or a note that says, I hope I never become dinner <laughs> sign. <laughs> Did we see what Spring it was? Card. Credit card. <laughs> Twenty bucks. Oh, sweet. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Something comes from the cave. Something comes from the cave. Right where that cart's at. I'm sure you all see it. Right where that cart's at. I'm sure you all see it. I don't see it. You don't see it? Do I hear double? You don't see it? I'm not in the room yet. I'm holding up the back, so I don't see what what's in the room. I can only see what somebody sees it. They're, they're providing pinging it, right it right now. Just walked into the room with a, with a note that you know it was a verbeeg in there. Just walked in there. Frank. Oh, look at all those goats. Friend or foe? Looks like my cousin Frank. <laughs> that is a verbeeg. That's a verbeeg. Yes. And he goes, he kind of says something. You don't know really what he says. What language does he speak? And he also immediately puts his hand to his mouth and whistles. He's got friends. So let's roll initiative. What language? He does not look happy. It was, you don't, do you speak Verbeek? Giant? Well, I speak giant. Do you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Giant. All right. Well, my tribe does. So, it, it kind of sounds... Well, don't don't roll initiative yet until I put the thing up. Um, he says, hey, friend, <laughs> want some goat? You want some... <laughs> or gnome? Gnome? <laughs> want some dwarf? Um, I happily take some gnome. <laughs> so, he basically says... Uh, you, you, but it's very broken. It's not exactly giant. It's some other weird dialect of giant and you can basically hear him say basically he calls out and he says hey and he says some word you don't really understand get in here that's basically all you that's basically all you understand get over here it's Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Yeah, and that's basically all you hear. He said it's a kind of a rough dialect of giant yeah. Is it Yeti by any chance? It is not Yeti. <laughs> okay. Is I it Yiddish? 
Okay. It's Yiddish. It's in it's Yiddish. Yiddish. <laughs> it's in Yiddish. All right. Now it's okay. okay. Yeah. Puzzle time. Yeah. Now I, that, uh, get the initiative uh, tracker out. Uh, yeah. He comes uh, yeah. walking in the room. <laughs> so, yeah, he, he whistles. He says yeah. something. He yells out something. And <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> hey, 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 get away that's from my wives. Hey, hey, it says, get away from my wives. <laughs> oh. Okay. Select your token. Are Roll your initiative. Yeah. Hold on. Select your token. Select token. Make sure you select your token and roll your thing. Roll your thing. Roll your thing. Roll an some of our viewers back. Hey, we got some of our viewers back. <laughs> All right. I'll leave. Okay, one sec. I'll be right back. Sorry. Do you have to click your token? Yeah, you have to select your token and then roll your initiative. And make sure you roll where it says initiative on your sheet. Yeah, me. Got it? Yeah. Very big. There you can see a picture of him. Very big marauder. It's in the chat. Okay. Everybody roll? Yep, yep that's everybody. That's everybody. Okay, I gotta roll his. Okay, I gotta roll. Except for the That's all right. There you go. Public roll. All right. He got a 3.11. Let's get it in order here. Oh. Not in order. Now it is. There we go. Yeah, my thing's running super slow. Okay, there we go. Yeah. All right, there's the initiative. Pinball Him, gets, gets to go first. Let's do this battle. I, I will ride. I will ride in a battle and go only five feet with my puppy, uh, and then I will use my lance to attack him with its ten foot reach. Okay. Oh what? Come on. All right, already starting. Oops. Oops. You just like. Just like missed him. <laughs> yeah, just missed him. Just missed him. <laughs> All right, what else do you do? That's it. That's it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Next up, Abbar. Let's do this battle. If you just tuned in, let's start started. They're battling a Verbeeg Marauder. Who just roasted somebody on a fire? I'm moving and start button. Uh, I will hit him with quarter staff. Hit him. Does a 15 hit him? A 15. Does it hit him? Good question. It? Yes, it does. Okay. Then he takes uh, uh, five damage. Let's do okay. him. Five damage? Five damage. Got it. Yep. And bonus action. Uh, I hit him with my op uh, open hand. So Got it. Go to one hand and you're just gonna piss him off. You're just gonna piss him off. I know. You just it's slap him. What I do? That's the point. Yeah. Oh. You didn't piss him off. You nope. missed him. Nope. 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 Okay. And then... Is that it? Yes. Okay. Yazo or Yarzo, sorry. Okay. I still can't see what's going on in there, but I hear some commotion, so I'm gonna come barreling into the room. Push pushing Mecca out of the way. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna go right here. No, I'm gonna go right here. 
Oh, so when I get in here, I see that big ass dude standing there. Yeah. And I turn right around and I head out. See you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, all right, I'm gonna cast. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just get crazy right here with one of my, one of my two first level Win. spells. Fireball. So, Fireball. I'm casting. I was gonna say he picked up a scroll of delayed blast fireball. Uh -huh. <laughs> How much XP is a goat worth? <laughs> um... We could get a quick level up before we fight this guy. <laughs> Kill all the goats and sheep. There. Goats and sheep. All right, I'm casting chromatic orb. And hey, that's a great a spell. Four inch diameter sphere of uh, acid. Okay. Four inch diameter spear of acid. Hey. Remember that spell in like second Four edition? Eight. Yep. I do. Yeah. I do. Let's see what happens. Spell. Whoa. Oh. Forget it. Whoa, that's yeah. a lot of dice. A lot of Everything dice dies with chromatic. Damn, is that 21 damage in acid? Yeah, it's a it's a badass spell. Unfortunately, it I think is. I might have missed. You did miss. Badass. <laughs> Whoa. I was like, gee, many Christmas. Yeah, chromatic orbs a lot. It's like it is. It's nasty. I know. I hate it's that spell. Three, three D eight. Three D eight. Yeah. Yeah, three D eight. It's a there's no there's more than three D eight out there. <laughs> yeah, why is there so many D eight out there? I think it rolled crit damage, didn't it? It still shows three D eight if you highlight it. Yeah, it does. It, it, just, it, it does the eight plus eight plus five. Adds extra die. Okay. The little three D thing isn't doesn't work right all the time. Got it. Yeah. All right. You're right, though. It did only roll a three, but but you missed. Hit, right? I think. But yeah, you missed. Five. So I missed. So that didn't work out. Okay. Uh, that's it for me. All right, uh, Chamberlain, you are up. Hey, that does take up a spell slot if I miss, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. See, this is why I'm not worried about this magician. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. I'm turning my aim on the next one. <laughs> Not the goats. <laughs> Each of these goats is worth like seven silver. <laughs> I'm gonna stay where I am. I'm gonna keep my light spell going because I mean it's just on the on the object anyway. Yeah, and then it's I'm on gonna you. Cast a, I'm gonna cast Toll the Dead. Okay. Uh, what does that do? One creature I see within range, and the sound of a of a dolorous bell fills the air around it for a moment. The target must succeed on a Wisdom saving throw. Wisdom saving uh, throw. Or take one d8 necrotic damage. If it's already missing hit points, it takes a d12 instead. Ooh, it's already missing hit points. Oh, I like the spell. Yeah. There you have it, right there, where everybody yeah, so can I see it. A, I need a Wisdom saving throw. He can do that. Here's a Wisdom saving throw right I hope here. He, I hope he can't do it. He. That he can't roll the spell? He doesn't look too wise. He, oh, he did, yeah, he got a seven. He is stupid. You guys can see that roll, right? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Max damage. Hmm. Ooh, for when the bell tolls. That's for when the bell tolls, buddy. Okay, so damage. Yeah. Twelve necrotic damage. Twelve necrotic. Got it. And no one's.